time in between. And think about this. Suppose an alien from another planet landed and, and, and you were doing Angry Birds and you had to explain to them the game. Okay, so here's what it is. So you have these birds and they have these eggs and these pigs come and they steal the eggs and they go to fortify themselves around the eggs. So the birds build this gigantic slingshot and they hurl themselves in a suicidal intent to break down the actual wall so they can get the eggs back. Okay, okay. Uh, we got a report from Earth. There is nothing serious here. We do not need to worry about these people. They are idiots, right? So, so this is this whole idea of how silly a game. Yet, here's the thing that I'm trying to point out to you: the fact that it's so popular tells me that it's compelling. That it's actually something fun and compelling to do. And it makes me think that that we need to start really seriously thinking about how we get that kind of loyalty, how we get that kind of compelling content involved in our online banking app. So, so people talk about the gamification uh, of banking, and I think we need, we need angry banking. We need angry banking, right? So what you do is you have your accounts, and you would basically you know, like take some money out of an account and put it in the slave time, and fire it right in your savings account. Why not? Why not? You know, I could have my three kids' accounts up there. You know, I could take $100. I could say, who's going to get it? Who's going to get it? So, okay, that's silly, but, but this idea is, is that we're coming into an age where people are going to look for that kind of compelling content. Somehow, we have to change the very nature of engagement with our customers at every contact point. Everywhere, it's going to become about engagement. 